Today is Saturday, and the plan is... I don't know where the day is going to take us. Let's go. Hey, guys. Benny is sick, and we've literally been watching him nonstop. He hasn't been pooping or eating, and for bunnies, that's really bad. When they don't eat or poop, it's because they're really sick. Today's been tough. Today, even though I spent some time with my family and I had a really nice time, it's been tough because of my bunny, or our bunny, and he's not doing so well. And we're trying to take care of him and we're doing the best that we can to give him the treatment that he needs but he's not doing well we have faith that he'll be he'll get better we do because i want to have faith i want to believe that he's going to be better and, and and i do and 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 it's hard because he's still not pooping <laughs> and uh, if you know anything about him that's not a good thing he's got to poop i mean anybody's got to poop right <laughs> if you didn't poop It'd be a problem. You gotta poop. Anyway, that's why today it's not really much. It's just have faith, even in times where things seem bleak and things seem like they're not gonna work out. Stick to your guns. I thought at the beginning of this, we uh, said, okay, let's do the treatment. He's gonna be fine. And then I just like pushed it out of my head, but I'm realizing that that's not enough. You can have faith that something's gonna work out, but maybe you. It requires you doing more work and sticking to it until it either works out or it doesn't. Because you're saying, oh, I have faith it's going to work out, and then walking away, I realize it's not, it doesn't make sense. Just because I gave him the treatment once, it means staying consistent and keeping, staying there with it. And that's the same thing with everything in life. If you love something enough, you'll do whatever it takes. And as long as it takes for you to see it work out or see it fail, both of which are very valuable results. With that said, I might add more content, maybe a little bit more of Benny, but if not, see you guys tomorrow. Here we are, yet again. Today, we are at the vet. It is, what time is it now? Almost, it's one. Almost one, twelve forty something. It's almost one. Oh, uh, we brought him. It turns out he's okay. He's gonna be he's fine. Not okay. <laughs> All right, he's not like super duper okay, but um. <laughs> That's crazy. Twelve forty. <laughs> see, I told you. Uh. But uh, he's gonna be fine. They're gonna give him some medication to help pass his uh his poopage. Uh, and then uh, we get to go home. So, in case you guys are wondering. We're okay. Anything else you'd like to say to the folks? Yes. <clears throat> I don't care about the money. <laughs> I don't care about the money that we waste. We invested. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care about the money. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna be like, is she okay? She drank a little bit of that hair. <laughs> Trying to calm the nerves. That's actually vodka right there. <laughs> it's not, it's not. We're gonna cut this out. So. Yeah, it's gonna, all that's gonna get cut out. <laughs> <laughs> People are gonna think we're like high. Alright, so yeah, so the bunny's fine. Um, What were you trying to say? I said that I don't care about the money that we invested in him. She said money's just a number, you know, money comes and goes. It's just something, you I know. I don't want to see him in pain. Yeah. Yeah. Money comes and goes. We know now that he's going to be fine. So that's the peace of mind. You can't put a price tag on that. Mm -hmm. Being like for sure now that he's going to be okay. Um. So yeah, man. Love your pets. Treat them with respect. And uh, happy days. <laughs>